Senator Isaacson announced new action in the fight against a deadly drug epidemic that has become personal for him. My grandson died of an overdose in 2016. He was one of the 63,300 that you listed in your testimony who died in 2016. The senator says he will co-sponsor a bill that aims to improve the federal government's response to the opioid epidemic through better communication and data sharing across agencies. The senator's grandson, 25-year-old Charlie Joyner, had sought help in the past. He was set to graduate from Georgia Southern with honors when tragedy struck. We were excited. And then we got the phone call late at night, uh, two days before the graduation, that he had been found dead in his apartment uh, in Statesboro, Georgia, which I bring up to say this. You never know where narcotics and opioids and overdose death is going to come from. You never know who it's going to affect. Senator Isaacson says he hopes the proposed law will remove the stigma around drug addiction and help treat it at what he calls a devastating disease. The Opioid Crisis Response Act targets a number of issues, including the development of non-addictive painkillers and other pain management strategies, drug prescribing behavior, and the CDC's work combating the crisis. The bill also addresses mental health services and health care access in underserved areas.